Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Aspen Farm. Joining Marcus on the second day of fall. This is episode number 10. Um, let's check all of this before we go out and I can start my preamble. So it's going to be sunny next episode. And today it is a really good luck day. Awesome. Cool. Welcome back. Welcome back. We have some mail that we got to check. Um, right. It's Blackberry season. Awesome. So we're going to spend some time. Welcome back. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you. We have some beer that we left in our inventory from last episode that we're going to pop in here. Um, and we have, ooh, we have some crops. Okay, so I think it might be time to grab some of these. Yeah, and we need a scythe for that. And we have corn. We have so many things. So many things. Okay, so we're going to put away some of this stuff. Let's go and grab this deluxe bait. Donk. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Put away everything in here. I'm going to put one in there. We're going to ship those. And we're going to... Is Marnie available on Mondays? I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know. Um, but we can grab these because we can go and... We need one, two, three... Three spots. And it's actually... There's nature fruit too, which is great. There. So we're going to ship the silver quality amaranth because Marnie doesn't need a quality one. <laughs> Don't need the cranberries for the community center. I can put you away in here, I think, right? We already have one, yeah. And I can put the scythe away now. Yeah, looks great. Hi, Rue. So because I have to do some funny business, all my animals have been pets. That's okay, because if you were to take a peek here, let's go to the bulletin board and we're going to go into the enchanters bundle. Oh my gosh, look at the pomegranates there. Um, so I did, I did a little bit of funny business just to um, make sure that the pomegranate that was there is back. That's all. So yeah, all of our animals are conveniently pet. And we got a snail. So I'm not going to reload our crab pots for the time being. Because we have gotten the last um, crab pot fish that we wanted. So that's, that's great. Let's see what's going on in here. I think we won't get a duck this episode because ducks usually take a little bit to incubate. So, But we'll start getting eggs again, which is great. I think we have, yeah, so it's gonna, it's only a cow day, I believe. Cow's milk, I should say. Let's try, but I'm pretty sure it's only, yeah, it's only cow's milk. So where is Azalea? Down here. What you doing way down here, Azalea? Hey. Thank you. Two, really? Y'all are... I guess they're half hearts now. Okay, wow. What the heck? Iris is already a full heart. Oh, did we miss Violet one of these days? Why does Daisy have half a heart more than Violet? That's weird. <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. Because we got them both the same day. So, I don't know what's happening. I just must have forgotten to pet one of them. Or maybe I didn't milk one of them one of the days. I'm not too sure. But, not the end of the world. Okay, so it is a Monday. Uh, we're going to go check the board, see what's, see if there's anything feasible. There's definitely going to be some um, special orders board quests that I'm just going to ignore, honestly, because they're just not a good use of time yet. Um, but there's some that are really beneficial to do as well. So we're going to kind of see how that plays out, see what we get, see what we get. Um, we're still working towards... Oh, it's also blackberry season, so we're going to be wandering around getting those. Still working towards the 25000 we need for the barn upgrade. And we have, by the end of this episode, to figure that out. I really hope Marnie is available. What the heck? Where is she? Mondays. Where is she on Mondays? Does she go to town? Is she in um, Pierre's? She might be in Pierre's. Okay, but we're going to run around and we're actually going to collect some blackberries because we only have 80 um, salmon berries left. And I want to make sure that we're set up really nicely for the rest of this season and winter. Because we might be doing some more combat-y, mines -y stuff during winter where we're going to we're gonna be working through a lot more health items, I would say. <laughs> um... So I think we are going to even reset the days too. As much as I didn't really want to, we're probably going to reset the days. Okay, 
Yeah, but I'm not going to be going out of my way to get, like, every single blackberry, if that makes sense. Like, we're just going to get... So we already have 21. Like, we're getting plus one from every bush that we did in the springtime. So that's already going to make our lives that much easier. It's so, like 33% less time. If we get around 200, we'll be in a really good spot. Really, really good spot. Um, we need to find Marnie though, so we're going to loop back around after we go into the super woods and get the hardwood there. We're going to loop back around and see if she's home or if we can catch her in transition to be going home. Um, there's not, there's, there's not, there's no new comments or anything for me to, um, chat about today because I'm recording this right after the last episode, even though it will be coming out a day after. Um, so yeah, there's no, there's not all been a whole lot of new action, which is completely understandable. That'd be shocking if there was comments in between, you know, two and a half hour period, but, so it's going to be more of a focus. The chat will be more focused on just the gameplay for this episode. Which I think is okay. I think it's good having a good mix of it so people can, you know, have that, that response. But then also if they like just the banter or go talking about Stardew, it's also there. Which I know we talked about regardless, but I think we spent a good, like I said, 40 minutes last episode just responding to comments and kind of talking through a lot of the, the feedback and stuff that we've been getting, so... Part of this process too is I'm keeping a close eye on... <laughs> how episode 9 is currently it's currently processing like it's uploaded but it's currently processing so i'm keeping an eye on that and i want to make sure that it's fully uploaded and processed before i do anything with the file because i have learned that the hard way let's just say that you need to wait until everything is fully done so because of that i think i can only effectively oh there you are i can only effectively do i just give it to her or is it the one where i walk in there i can't remember if this is the one where i walk in or is that the cape carrot We'll wait until she goes in to see if we get the... I feel like the cave here is the one where she runs at you. Yeah, so this one we just give to her. There we go. Thanks for that money. $500. That's actually really awesome. Okay, let's go check special orders board now. But anyways, what I was saying is um, I can really only record two episodes before... Uh, the amount of memory, the amount of space on my, my computer starts to run a bit out <laughs> so i'm gonna record this episode upload it and i'm gonna putz around doing other things until you know the other episode is up oh yay okay we're gonna do ectoplasm we are going to do the ectoplasm because that will give us mini obelisks which will be very nice very nice bread trash bread oh i thought we got two but it's i just picked up the trash bread um oh the booksellers marcello's here hi leah how are you doing i found some wild mushrooms over the weekend Awesome. We need to buy one, two, three, four. Four wheat. We're just going to hold that until some of these other crops are ready. We're just going to put these into the soil. Hi, Maru. I don't feel like I talk to you enough, Maru. Have you explored the mines much? I've heard that I can find some useful materials there. I think you could too, for, you know, depending on what you're working on. Oh, I haven't been over here at all. Okay. I just want to see if he's selling any like new books. We, we're not going to buy anything because again, we, we're, we have our money planned to be used elsewhere. Oh, I don't have any books to trade in though, but so we have Woody Secrets. So we got one of those for hardwood, but we used it for EXP. We've gotten a monster companion, but you need two for the slime incubator. We've also got Jack be nimble so we could get stuffing, which is interesting. Haven't gotten you, haven't gotten you. I wonder how, like, frequent these books are, if, like, they're... Hmm. Okay. And none of these really look new. Read this again, some forging XP. Yep. Oh, I really want this Slither Legs one so bad. And, of course, the book. But also The Way of the Wind, which is affordable, but we're not going to get it. So, sorry, Marcello. Not, not today, my friend, unfortunately. Because, again, we need to hold on to this money for a barn to get a pig to get a truffle. The main reason why I'm so insistent on it is because we can't get a truffle during the winter unless it's from the traveling merchant. So it's like, this one is very time gated. Not saying that we have to complete it year one, but it'll just feel bad waiting till like spring first for a truffle. 
Or a rabbit? A rabbit can make a rabbit's foot like whenever, right? So. I still haven't even gotten a. Um. Oh, I need to be careful about these blackberries. Where's the regular quality ones? Yeah, because those will filter in, and we don't want those to filter in. Let's do some eggplant. Yeah, I think this will be pickled eggplant. Yes. And I might just sell this red mushroom, honestly, because we can't dry it, so... Because it needs to be edible stuff that you're drying, so I might just... Oops, I can put in pickled corn as well. That's, sounds horrendous. Oh, did I buy an extra? There's only three I needed. That's okay, we have a backup one. Um, okay, so now we need to go and kill some ghosts. Let's go and do that. Let's go and pop some ghosts, eh? Hey? See if we get a wild plum along the way. There's Linus. Oh, right, we were doing some blackberry stuff. Uh, don't want to do some blackberry stuff instead. It was a no, it's a really it's a really good luck day. Maybe we'll do ghost stuff because it's a really good luck day. So just being able to like cycle through a lot of floors a bit quicker will be nice. Robin's done work for the day, getting some fresh air. Guess we can get some of this moss, why not? Oh yeah, I forgot we could swing our swords at the bushes too for the berries. I forgot that, that was built in. Slime Arena, our, our little slime mascots hanging out there. <laughs> okay, so we are going to do probably like my 50 stuff. There we go. Yeah, because there's, there's usually like, I hesitate to say reliably, but like kind of reliably a ghost on these floors. No first kill ectoplasm. That's okay. That's okay. Is there a ghost on this floor? Ooh, there is. Wow. No ectoplasm from that one either. That's fine. But did we get a... The, um, whatchamacallit? <clears throat> Billboard request? No, we didn't, eh? No ghosty on this. Oh, there is a ghosty on this floor. Wow. And there's even some dusties. Nice. Ghosties and dusties and bats. Bat baddies and slimies. <laughs> and there's a slime on the bottom left. We'll see if I... We'll see if I end up going down there. No ghost. No, I think we'll just reset. And dump in there. We can put it on once we leave. So we have enough furnaces that I think it'll be okay. It'll work out nicely. A diamond! That's a lot of VXP. No ectoplasm. If only we had the burglar's ring, we probably would have gotten it by now. <laughs> it's okay. We'll get it when we get it. Oh, thank you. A mystery box. Again, once we get the barn, then we can actually dive into those mystery boxes a little bit more, see what's going on there. I don't know why I took my pickaxe out for that, but I did. Oh, nice. No ghost, because I think it would have been flying towards us already. Will you give us an ectoplasm? The answer is yes. Crap, I tried. <laughs> I was manifesting there. So interesting how dusty sometimes break rocks like that. Like, I wonder what provokes that interaction. Okay, we've actually... Is this ghost number six, I think? Five or six. That's okay, it's... 
Oh, but we got a lot of gold ore from it. That's nice. Yeah, I think just being able to get through the floors quicker is nice, nicer than like the increased spawn. Cause I mean, it's only one ghost per floor anyways, right? And they're pretty frequent. Like they have like a, I don't know. There's probably actually someone knows the percent chance, but it feels like almost an 80% chance to spawn on these floors. Seem a lot. The slime blended in. I thought it was a rock. Still, again, we're gonna be so stone deprived until we get like the staircase system going. I'm gonna cough one second, that's interesting. It wasn't a sneeze, it was a cough because I'm a little sick. Holy, I want to get this though while we're here. Okay, three stones, we'll take it. As this floor doesn't always have a ghost, the, the big circular ones are a little bit better at having a ghost. Whoa! Okay, even if there's no ghost here, there's a lot of dusties. That's awesome. Bring the bat over to this dusty. What the heck? I don't want to be here forever waiting for bats. I'm not going to wait for them. Because we have, our eyes are on ghosts, and I think we can only get this reset for today. Do we see one flying at us? Oh my gosh, what the heck? Those mystery boxes really pop out on those good luck days, hey? So no ghosts on that floor, ghosts on this floor. We can check out uh, 53 as well. So it won't take too long to get there. on this floor either. Wow, finishing off not too strong, hey? Get this dusty and then we're out of here. Let's get out of here. I'm gonna smelt some stuff up before we go though, so that it'll be ready for us the next time we, oops, that we pop up here. Okay, let's drop off everything that we can, including some new stuff here. I don't know if I'm putting geodes in here, but eh. Um, new you and you. Yes, that's what we will do. Drop it all off and let's get out of here because it's 1 a.m., which is terrifying. Oh my gosh, I'm not usually in the mines this late. Eee. So I was alt tabbing to so I could watch the processing because I again I'm just like traumatized. I've only ever had that one instance, and again, I've been uploading videos like you know, my hemlock series is in the 230s, and I've never had this kind of issue with processing, but it only takes once for me to start freaking out. Oh, are these the first cave carrots I'm running back? Interesting. Alright, and I guess that's the first crystal fruit in there too. So again, I'm going to load in the game, but then restart the game. Yes, please sleep. Please sleep. Whoa, uh, we made 3200, 3300. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm happy with that. Just so that when we're running around and getting the blackberries, we don't have to like search as high and low, you know, when we're looking for them. So I'm going to exit to title and you're going to see that I have the generic mod config menu here. And that's because I, again, I just had to, I had to get the pomegranate in here. We're not actually modding. I know this is, it is a vanilla series, but again, I've explained in the last episode why I did some stuff the way that loaded so fast. Why I did the things, the things I did, right? So. We're not actually using mods. I only used mods to recreate this parallel dimension exactly the same as the last one. Dear Marcus, one week from today, we are holding the Stardew Valley Fair in the town square. It's the biggest event of the year, drawing people from all across the country to our humble town. If you'd like, you can set up a grange display for the event. Just bring up to nine items that best showcase your talents. You'll be judged on the quality and diversity of your display. The fair starts at 9 a.m. Don't miss it. From Mayor Lewis. Cool. Sounds great. Um, ooh, we have two morels. 
Let's say good morning to Rue. We also have some honey so we can make and some mead that I forgot that we could make. I think I'm putting it in here, right? Yeah, so we will do that. Good morning, Rue. Do some animal things. I think they should be wanting pets, yeah. It was just that first episode because of what I had enabled that I couldn't disable until I loaded the game, which made it a little tricky. Is that everyone? I feel like I missed a few. Oh no, I got everyone, wow. Oh my gosh, we can almost do a morel one again. Nice, morels are, yeah, a lot more money. That's cool, that's another 1,000 there on top of whatever goodies we got here. Um, duck egg? Duck egg! Okay, so I'm gonna ship this duck egg because we need to register it in the shipping collection before we do anything else. And then the next one, the next one will be when we finally make a duck mayo. It's all part of the process. And it looks like it is a goat day. There we go. And did that help Daisy? It did, okay. Or Violet, I don't remember which one it was. One of them wasn't as um, affectionate, <laughs> I guess, as the other ones. Oh shoot, was that two large milks? Oh no, I forgot I need to ship a large goat milk. Okay, we need to keep our eyes out for that. I'll remember though. Also, these fences are staggered. That's gonna bother me, but again, they're gonna start they're gonna start dying on us soon, so. Okay, let's sell off of these goodies. Oh, we have a tree. Oh. Can they lose their leaves? That's cool. I didn't know they could just like lose their leaves. I thought they would have just had their leaves lost. Ooh, and pale ales already, so we can do some mead. And we can do... Um, let's do cranberry, because I kind of want the um, the wine to ship, even though I know we're going to be getting tons more wine probably in the future. <clears throat> we're not going to be a wine monopoly by any means, but I mean, kegs are too good to not, not use. <laughs> okay, so we need to do ghosty things, but I think we'll go and do some hardwood things, because we probably have actually... Let's go and check. Let's see how many mahogany trees we can plant. Okay. I was expecting more, but so be it. Um, but at least we can go up here and just check what's going on over here. Boom, boom, ding. Oh, this tree grew up a little bit. Nice. Oh, and these trees are growing really well. Did they change the growth rates of mahogany trees? I don't remember them growing that, like, effectively. This is doing okay. The wheat's still okay. <coughs> Sorry, my throat is so gunky and yucky. This is wasted money right now, but kind of wanting to use that for forage to really try to get to level 10 foraging. Mm -hmm. Berries. Yeah, we'll come out and then we'll loop down south, I think, once we, once we chop down the, oops, the things that we want to chop down here. Oh, a mahogany seed from you. Thank you. Oh, that slime just kind of came out of the top of these trees here. It was like, hello, good morning. <laughs> I see you hiding up here, blackberry bush. Donk. And soon, older old master cannoli, we will be able to interact soon, my friend. I don't even know how much hardwood we have. I haven't been checking. I've kind of just been throwing it in the chest and running away. little blackberry loop here. I guess we can clean up some of this debris too while we're... Oh, any tool works. Interesting. 
I'm not gonna go into like the center part, just like this outer ring. No matter how tempted I am, we have other objectives that we gotta kind of focus on. Da -da -dum. That'd be cool if there was quests to be able to fix up the hat mouse's house a little bit. I know there's mods that do it, and it's, it really makes a big difference, but that'd be cool if there was like a quest line to fix it up. I'll get the moss too, why not? I'm already swinging my sword at plants, why not swing them at all the plants? If it's not too out of the way. If it's a bit out of the way, I'm not going to do it. Okay, that's, that's pretty good. We're at like 87, so we've already doubled the amount of healing food that we have. Um, we'll go through the backwoods. We won't just take the minecarts, so we can get those ones too. I know there's a mushroom there. I'm choosing to ignore it. <laughs> Let's drop, uh, yeah, we'll just drop off the, ah, uh, no, we'll make some tree fertilizer for these mahogany seeds. Oh, we're already up to 73. That's actually really awesome. Okay, so we need one, two, just two. Yeah, I want to get these growing because these give so much more hardwood than stumps <laughs> and we can shake them to try and be at like a net zero in terms of how many we're getting yeah they always take so long to grow even fertilized I should think about where I want to put those sprinklers too because I think pumpkin day will come up this episode I'm not too sure I could also grab Linus's blackberry basket. Broccoli? Yay. That's so cool. I love how the fall crop is broccoli. Like it's like, I don't know, maybe it's because it's like, might have like such like a North American grocery store brain right now, but I'm like broccoli is such like a staple, just like vegetable to me at least. Like it's like, you, you know, you think about vegetables and it's like carrots and broccoli. <laughs> At least in like the house I, or like house and family, I guess I grew up in, right? That was like a very, oh, I want that so bad. I know it's very out of the way, but we've been looking for one for a while. So we're going to go for it. This is crazy thinking that episode nine um, <clears throat> that I recorded today is going to go live in less than 12 hours. Like that's how um, caught up everything got with me trying to adjust so yeah that's a little crazy 99 that's good yeah i'm happy with that we don't need a we don't need to sweat out stuff too much here i think we have enough yeah let's just go down i don't need to clean up my inventory too much oh we got two wild plums from that that's awesome yeah like i could have planted pumpkins there but it really bothers me when crops are desynced There being the new plot that has nothing in it. Sorry, context. I also, did I check the luck today? I think I checked the luck, but I don't remember what the luck is at all. At all. There was also no ghost there. Where's our ghost friends? Where's our ghost friends? Let me drink some water. That's the drink of the day today. Just plain old water. Just plain old water. Might get some tea later on. I wonder if they like flipped it so it's like good luck means lots of monsters. I don't know. Because I know bad luck, at least from what I heard, uh, was that bad luck meant more monster spawns. So, don't know if that's changed. Sorry, I was moving the mic if there's a little bit of rustling. Get these ores, why not? I wish there was like a level 80s and a level 20s equivalent of dust sprites they gave because then you could like not just get like such a surplus of iron 
you can kind of balance it out between the copper and the gold as well. <clears throat> is my gosh just had a panic attack that I've been recording for 30 minutes and my mic wasn't on but we're good I see the green bars moving on OBS so we're good what is not good is not getting a stair down oh. alright never mind just complaining I guess where are the ghosts where are the ghosts I'm complaining Your phone is. There we go. Oh, dusty. We always like those dusties. We got a long journey with these dusties. There's the ghost. A ghost. You're the one. You're the one. Right here. You're just ectoplasm. It's right there. I tried. There's a lot of monsters on the floor. What the heck? Also, what was I doing that used so much of my energy? hoeing things. I know I cut down stumps, but I didn't think that they would use that much energy. Is that just me? Is that just me? Sorry, adjusting the mic again. I can already feel it sagging. Man, this mic sand is like not the best. It's like it's like a blue branded mic stand for the blue yeti but like for some reason like it's it's one where you twist the knob to like tighten the arm but it doesn't ever fully tighten it i don't know maybe it's because i've kind of ruined it myself but i feel like no matter what i do it like oh i thought my bestie was dead but i was just standing in it no matter what i do it sags this is my knee xp right here Come on, ghosty. Man. Nothing yet. I don't want to like hoe this one spot. I don't know. It just looks funny. <laughs> Let's do this one too. Donk. Nope. We are going to be wanting to work towards the, um, sorry, I gotta rub my eye for a second. I'm going to be wanting to work towards the Dwarf Scroll 1 and Dwarf Scroll 4. Which I know Dwarf Scroll, actually both I think we can get from Tilly Soil, but it might only be in like the level 80s or deeper. Man. I'm just going to run past these because there's a freebie ladder, so... Um, ghost. Get the dusties and then get out. Oh, there's so many dusties. Why are you running away? Why are you running away? Okay. We have, to be, have we already gotten the bat, Monster Slayer? I don't think so. That's okay. 11, 10.30, jeez. Okay. We will continue. Hopefully we get at least one more ghost. Oh, there's one. Lots of monsters. Lots of chances for staircases. That's all I see. Oh, a refined quartz, though. Thank you. That's like the next best thing to this ectoplasm right now. You saved us a whole piece of coal, Ghosty. Thank you. So when I was prepping the monster eradications to get them to the same number they were at before, I would I spawned like a hundred dust sprites because I think I had a hundred and like thirty six or something dust sprite kills. I don't remember, but I spawned a hundred just to get the hundred kills in, and I got fifty one coal. So I was like, okay. That's a good sample size of one to know that you get coal about 50% of the time from dust sprites. Don't know if that's actually what it is or like if that reflects the correct numbers, but that was the experience right there. And I was like, okay, that's good to know that one out of every two dusties will actually give you coal. Uh, it doesn't look like an ectoplasm day today either. It's kind of a bummer, but you know what? We will continue on regardless. Just want to see if a ghost starts floating towards us in here. Doesn't look like it because we would have seen them by now. So 
let's get out of here. Let's grab our smelting, put on more smelting. Which is probably just gonna be more iron because we have so much of it now, which is about to happen, you know, resetting these floors so much. We have 20 coal though, that's really nice. Is there anything in here we wanna bring back? I mean, we can bring back the cave carrots. It'll be nice to have them on us. So Marnie will, or at least Marnie wants one. <laughs> no, oh, there is a wild plum over there. Nice, okay, so I feel good about shipping one now that we have three. More broccoli as well. Oh, the meat is already ready, wow. We're gonna ship you. Now let's put everything away. Cool, and then we'll grab one, two, two, and how many fall seeds can we make? Two, because we have two, right, 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 right. And put those there, we're going to hang on to those until the first batch is ready, because again, it irks me so much when the same type of crop is desynced. Hey, we got two shipping page items today. Excellent. <clears throat> Whoa, 3,800. Nice. That's good money. That's good money. It's day 10, which is making me a little nervous that we're not getting as much money as I would hope. I could sell some of the forage, right? Like the mushrooms and such. Oh, I didn't even check the letter or the TV. Okay, weather report says it is cloudy, windy, and we got a good luck day. Okay. Any crops? No crops. I could fish. Oh, I didn't restart. That's okay. Honestly, that's fine. I think we'll be okay with the amount of blackberries we're currently sitting on as well. Did I put any community? No, I just put a Gunther item in there. Okay, and we're hanging out on the Gunther items for a little bit. Just a little bit. These will be ready soon. I think they have one more growth stage before their mature growth stage. Rue's bowl. I love how it tells you sometimes. I don't know. And Rue loves us, so we might be getting that um, message soon. One, two, three, four, five, six, and did I, seven? Did I get everyone? I got everyone. Nice. Is it a mushroom day? I always forget. No, but we can grab those. But uh, actually, I think we have some common mushrooms that we can flip. Yeah. Why not stay on top of these? Because this is money. This is money. Okay, let's get some eggs. I think it's just a chicken egg day. Duck feather day? No. It might be more worth to sell those iridium chicken eggs. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, yay. It's a four cheese day, though. That's really good, which means that it is just a two milk day. Yeah, I don't think we can milk you. No. Sorry. I'm sorry. Ew, don't get too upset with me. Put you away. And nice. We have some decent stuff to sell. Okay. We're 23. Actually, this will. Ooh, you know what I might do is let's go and sell this stuff to Pierre. Let's sell this stuff to Pierre. And then we can go to Robin's right after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Wait, how much is it? I want to bring 550 and 300. I didn't want to do that. Yeah, because then we can. We should be able to just build this right away. I don't know how much this will sell for. 345, 230, so 500 thousand and oh yeah okay we're good yeah because that'll be really feel really good to get the barn upgrade going and 300 stone 300 stone yes i don't know if these mushrooms i think i think the dried mushrooms can be sold to pierre i think i don't know Grab the berries on the way, why not? Ooh, the maple syrup as well, sure. Sure. Mm -hmm. 
What notebook? One of my notebooks is getting really wrinkly. Um, bok choy. Why do you? You're so creative. No, 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 no. That's so sad. And some of you are probably like you, you goof. Of course, he's closed on Wednesdays. Ah. Uh, all right, I'm getting the barn tomorrow. Requesting the barn tomorrow. 11th, done by the 14th. Oh, that's so scary. Will Marnie be in her house on that day, though? I'm hoping this blue grass makes them grow up faster. So it would be 1, 2, 3. Actually, maybe the 13th. So Saturday. She's usually there Saturday and Sunday, isn't she? One of those days, especially. Okay, well, let's sell this stuff because we don't really have any other choice. So... Ah, crap. Put you in here. I'm gonna actually store these in here too, just so I don't have to worry about finagling them out again. Let's go to Secret Woods, get a little bit more hardwood. It's also forging EXP, I guess, which is nice. Then do our quick little loop for blackberries and come take a little dip down here. This could get a little messy if I'm not careful. Okay. Nice. Bubbles, don't really need those. Because, yeah, of course I want to start working on the vault as well, but... The vault is like... That That will be fun for... That will be fine for winter time. I think we'll be okay if we don't get to it until winter time. Okay. Oh, that's nice. I wasn't like trying to hit the bush there, but I did. Saved us one swing. <laughs> nice. And again, we're not trying to be efficient here. We're not trying to grab every single blackberry alive. I don't think we need. We really don't need that many, honestly. Especially, like, I think if they had level 10 foraging, um, I would maybe stress it a bit more, but again, we weren't we weren't trying to be the most efficient to get level 10 foraging, because there is a way, like, you know, like, I, I know how to do it, and I could have wanted to, but that's not the point of this playthrough. The point of the playthrough is to just do things as we naturally feel fit to do it, right? And that meant not trying to force tea saplings or whatever reason we would have, right? Um, okay, not as many, but that's because we didn't restart the day, so that makes sense why. But we're already at 139, which is great. loop down here. Maybe we can grab Linus's basket on the way back too. Just so he has that, because that one just gives friendship, I believe. Come over here so we can go into town and then through the bus stop, which probably isn't the most efficient way of getting back, but eh. I don't mind. I know some of you very much mind, but... <laughs> Get rid of this over here. This doesn't really benefit us. This is such a weird area. Like, I feel like there should be something here. Maybe there will be. I don't know. <laughs> There's just like a weird area. This is like a backyard, but not actually a backyard for anyone. There should be some berries over here for sure, because yeah, we haven't really gone over here yet. There we go, you found Linus's berry basket. Okay, then we'll do a quick drop off of all this stuff and then we will go to the backwoods, meet up with Linus partway. I'm so sad that Pierce was closed. I'm so sad that I forgot that he was closed. I always forget. Um, drop off these resources, see how much hardwood we're up to. 85, not bad. 
off our little bits and bobs of slime that we got. All right, let's get our last little bit of, I think tomorrow, like the 11th is the last Blackberry day. So we're already doing good at 154. Yeah, we'll be fine. If we don't get to 200, I'm not gonna scream and cry and thrash on the ground. No, it's fine. So we still have 80 here as well, right? So we're already at 240, so to speak. Where is Mr. Linus? Is he by the lake? Let's get this blackberry tree here over. Tree, jeez, what the heck? What am I doing, playing Rapidax? Um, not in there, that's fine. He might be up by the um, bathhouse. Oh no, there he is. Ooh, a hazelnut. Don't mind if I do. We got the mushroom too. That's 7 foraging XP. Potentially 14. It was 14 because we got 2. Nice. Um, Linus, I have something that you lost, my friend. How is our friendship right now? One heart. My basket. Thank you. This means a lot to me. It means a whole heart worth to you. Holy. Yeah, you, you're you welcome, buddy. Okay, so I think what I might do is I might actually smelt some stuff now. Actually, no, we're fine. We're fine. Let's see if we can get a ghosty. We have good luck. We don't have, a, like, amazing luck today, but we have good luck. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. So we should get more ghost spawns than a typical day. I don't know. Maybe less. I don't know. I don't know how the monster spawning system works. I don't think I've ever seen two ghosts on a floor in the regular mines. Skull Caverns. Oh, yay. That's another thing that we want. Skull Caverns is very different, obviously, but... I don't know. I don't think carbon ghosts give... Uh, maybe they do give ectoplasm. I don't know. I don't think I've ever actually just done this special order quest when um, I've been in the Skull Caverns. So I've always usually done it before beforehand, so I don't know. Ghost? Crates? Sure. Alright, lots of stone and coal. It's never a bad thing. Yay, a ghost. Nope, not from that one. That's okay. Maybe we should go check our Dusty's kill count, because I actually don't know what, like, I'm assuming it'll be in maybe, like, high 200s, low 300s. That'd be really nice. I think it was, it was around, it was like 156 or something, I think is what it was. When I, when we started fall. I'm slow. This floor is darker than normal, is that just me? I don't know what's happening. Okay, we're gonna go to, yeah, we're gonna go to the Adventurers Guild and see what's going on there. We can also check in with all of our other monster eradication stuff. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, 292 slimes and 282, so high 200s. Yeah, that's about right. Okay. Have we killed a thousand monsters yet? 909. Ooh, just a hundred to go. That's so exciting. That's so exciting. Yay, there's a ghost. I was like, hold, I was like, had bated breath there. I was like, please. No. No. <laughs> Have you guys ever gotten the ectoplasm? Or I guess the, what is it called? The prismatic jelly? Have you ever gotten that on your first kill? Your first ghost or your first floor i guess finding the prismatic slime because once you find the prismatic slime it's it's like guaranteed you're gonna get the jelly but i have not personally oh the processing has now changed from three hours to 120 minutes we're doing great yeah slotted for midnight pst or sorry midnight mst 
which means that that'll be 11 p.m. PST and it will be 2 a.m. EST if you are North American. Or I guess 1 a.m. Central Time too, so it's some Central Time folks. Um, time zones beyond that elude me. It's like morning time in like the UK, I think, right? Because they're like seven or eight hours ahead of where I live. So it's like, yeah, it'd be morning time, I think, for UK when the episode comes out. Don't know. That'd be cool. That'd be cool to hear is like, when does like the, the episode release for you? Because I don't know, I just, it's nice because it arbitrarily starts at like midnight for like if, when you schedule an episode to release on YouTube. And I'm like, well, okay, why not just keep these ones midnight? It's fine. People will come to it when they have time. The, the release time of it doesn't really influence anything, nor should it. Oh, it's blue. We have blue. I think as long as it's consistent, that'd be nice, right? At least, personally speaking, it'd be like, hey, yeah, sure, if it comes out at midnight my time, I'm 100% asleep. But then I know that every morning I would wake up and there'd be an episode. That's what I was thinking when I was doing that, at least. I can't remember why I decided... Oh, a mystery box. Why I decided 7 p.m. my time for the Hemlock series, but I did. And I think I was doing the Mistral series when I was still actively recording it, which I will get back to. I know some of you really enjoy that. Um, I was doing that series. It was noon, like 12 o'clock noon my time is when those episodes went up. Just a little bit of a change depending on the series, right? So it's different time of day, different expectation in terms of what will be there. Different mindset. No. We'll go down one more and see if we get the ectoplasm there. Or the ghost, I guess. <laughs> hey, ghost. Ghost? Because sometimes there's ghosts on the floor. Sometimes they're a little far away, so it might take a little bit. Oh my gosh, there's so many dusties, though. Okay, if we didn't get to like 300 today from all of these, then I don't know what's going on. Hello? There's no ghost, because it would have gotten to us by now. Man, two coal. That's good. We're already 17 coal in our inventory. Okay. I think we might be able to do 51 check, but beyond that, that might be a bit of a gamble. Because it's already, yeah, it's already midnight. Oh, there's a ghost. Worth it. Four dusties too. Please be ectoplasm. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it actually was the ectoplasm. Nice. Our last ghost of the night, and it actually gave us like what we were hoping to get. Um, let's grab these. We can grab these too, sure. I mean, actually, no. We probably won't even need them. Never mind. We're fine. Okay, we have coal, we have copper, we have iron, and we have gold. Excellent. That was a, that was a successful day. <gasps> oh my gosh. Still traumatized by the possum. Is it possum or opossum? I think it's an opossum. I know that it's... They live in different parts of the world. That's why there's the two names. But And I think I was reading, was it someone's comments on another video? Where they were like, is it a possum or is it an opossum? Oh, I just brought everything home with me when I didn't mean to. And I think, I don't know, it depends on where you're framing this game. How are we doing? 2139. Oh, we're doing really good. Okay, we actually just need some copper. Right, if you're thinking this game takes place in North America equivalent or if it takes place in Europe equivalent. Which again, probably dictates from not dictates but like stems from where you personally live yourself all right thursday the 11th we got traveling cart tomorrow well it's another windy day and we have a good luck day cool so we can putz around a little bit i think we can probably check to see if forge is ready it might have been ready yesterday too but i just suck <laughs> checking so there we go. Any crops? Ooh, eggplants. Yay. And it's gonna be barn day. It's gonna be barn day. When is the Stardew Valley Fair? I just picked the yam. I didn't even know the yam was ready. 
Okay, we might leave that plot. Oh wait, we have another yam here. I might leave these two plots empty because things might be coming up soon. So I can ship one. I can put one in here to take. And we'll probably take it over when the the pumpkins are ready. Because the pumpkins will be ready in two days, two or three days. Um so yeah, we'll 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 deal with that when it when it comes up. Let's say good morning to Rue though. Rue loves you. Yay. Okay, so I do this with most of my playthroughs. Please don't judge me too hard. As soon as our pet loves us, I kind of stop frequently watering them. <laughs> um, which is horrible if you think about it. It's like not giving these poor animals water. But, oh, Remy's, hello. Um, I don't know. I it, It's like a sign for me to pivot and start focusing on... Where is Aster? It's always Aster. Um, it's just a sign to be like, hey, check. Did great. What's next? Is it a goat day? It's a goat day. Oh, no. That was not what I wanted to do. Do you give us a large milk? Yay. Oh, my gosh. There's a gold star large milk, too. Holy. Okay, so we need to ship one of those because we haven't yet. I don't think we... Do we need that for the animal bundle? No, because we finished the animal bundle. Right. We can take the ectoplasm to the wizard tomorrow. Actually, we're going to be going down there anyways because it's... It's Blackberry Day, so... Okay, let's put the small milk in. Yeah, we're going to be going down there for blackberries anyway, so that's fine. I'll just pull it up so I remember. That's not being pulled up. And duck feather? No, but duck egg. So this is going to be our first duck mayo, which is great. And it was, was that a gold star? So we're going to get like a, a really decent quality duck egg or duck mayo as well. Awesome. Did we pet everyone? Did I get everyone? I did. Yay. Uh, it's, I think it's a mushroom day too. Yes. Cool. And there's five commons right here. So we should be able to just... Actually, let's do more else because those will be... That will give us more money. Weave our way through. Sell off the goods. And let's go to Robin's before we do anything else. There we go. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, because it's pumpkin day, I should think about... No, I don't think it... Uh, we could hoe some ground in preparation. I don't know. Mm. We also need to check our forage because I think our forage might be up. Yeah, I think our forage might be up. Robin, I have a request. Please be here. Yay. Yes, I do. Can you build me? Sorry, she said I need something built, so I'm responding to her prompt. So close. 100 hardwood. Okay. Five iron bars. We got that. This is smaller. I think I was reading somewhere and it wasn't like, I was like, okay, I'm fine with being spoiled by this because that was just me being ignorant. This looks smaller, hey? So I think that they changed the slime hutch footprint. Build a deluxe barn, please. And I would like you, ooh, pale ale is ready to build that into a deluxe barn. Thanks. Okay, I'll start working on your barn for upgrade first thing tomorrow morning. What do you have here? Oh, right. Okay, so because now we have a little bit more discretionary money to buy some stuff. I am going to be wanting to buy these. Oh, that's so funny. Okay, I'm going to buy that because we should have that, honestly. And we should have that. Um, I just maybe acquired those materials by other means. Um, <laughs> I'll buy the other ones, too. Don't worry, I'll buy the other ones too. Especially before I like use them. So I don't remember if I've bought the other two. Might be confusing things. Um Piers is open, but we don't need to go to him necessarily. Hi Abby. Oh, uh, Jade from the trash. Alright, sure. Oh no, there we go. 
<laughs> Sorry, how can you tell when I'm never actually looking at my Stardew window? Ah. Okay, again, I'm not going to be the most efficient with my time. I apologize, but... I like just wandering around too and exploring. I don't know, it's kind of nice, and especially with blackberry season. It's it's whatever, right? Was it worth coming all the way here for one blackberry bush? Probably not. Did we do it anyways? Yes. Also, please don't hate me for ignoring so much moss. I don't know, for some reason, that to me is not worth going all the way for. I don't know why. I don't know why that's in my brain. Uh, let's grab two more pale eels, two more hops. And then we can store some of this stuff. Then we'll go visit the wizard and take care of all that. Can we make more forage seeds? Because I, I might actually just bring them with me just in case. Nice. Ten. Okay, and let's grab these. So we have 30 to replace the 30 that are there, but then we'll be able to make more. Let's see what's going on over here. Nope, not ready yet. That's okay. Um, yeah, I'm gonna wait to plant them again just because these are gonna be ready soon, and it'll annoy me to no end if they are desynced by one day. I'm not that desperate for level 10 foraging. Not that desperate. I think it's um, it's still the. Uh, um, the plums. My gosh, sorry, I was like, it's leaving my brain what they're called. The, the spice plums? Wild plums, jeez. I don't know why. Spice berry. I'm just combining forage names right now. Um, it's leaving my brain. Easy slime eradication kills. What the heck, never mind that slime took forever to kill. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I think maybe once we plant, mm, no, we'll wait because I think we're gonna be getting the greenhouse. So once we kind of figure out a plan with the greenhouse, um, and we kind of hoe what we want in there, which we can. The, the the wow, sorry, brain going too fast. The soil in there does not become untilled if you hoe it, so that's nice. So we could always just go in there, hoe all the soil, regardless of where we're at with sprinklers, and then send in our hoe again because I'd like to get a gold hoe sooner than later that'd be really nice and then winter time is when we'll do uh, our watering can that's fine nope 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 not bad okay so that was what we were at before it was like 80 something so this will be 90 something so one more day and then we'll have enough hardwood for the stable And then we'll have those mahogany trees coming up soon. We got two more right here, which is nice. Maybe next episode will be an electrolytes episode. Maybe that will help me feel a little bit better. I don't know, is it a placebo? Maybe. Hello, wizard. Oh, I should have brought you a mushroom, I'm sorry. Ah, it's bringing me with the energy of forgotten souls. Perfect. Now be gone. I shall require a perfect silence to discern the true nature of this substance. <laughs> what a guy. 2,500. Holy. What were we using our money on? The floors, right. I don't know. We're probably not going to make it up to Robin's in time to get more of those. We're using our money on a lot of things, honestly. So That's that's um, a vault bundle right there, though. So that's one consideration. Going to be getting more from our animal products. Let's check hat moss. We haven't checked hat moss in a while. Straw hat in inf infinity. Oh, oops, that was spoilers. Sorry. Eee, sorry, sorry, sorry. You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. Don't look. Don't go back. Don't go back. Oh, that's because I made a big oops. I made, I made a big oops. That should not be there. That is not there. You didn't see anything. We're just getting blackberries. We're getting blackberries. That was me doing a big oops. So I'm not going to visit the ha hat mouse like ever. I'm not going to scroll to the bottom of the hat mouse, let's just say. I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, I created a spoiler. I created a spoiler. 
If you were hopefully a little zoned out to that point, just leave it at that. Just leave it at that. And also, let's try to keep that that portion out of the comments too for folks that don't want to have that knowledge yet. Um, yeah. Because I kind of spoiled myself a little bit there too, which is upsetting, but that's fine. We're at 259. We have so many. What was I going to do? Um, I was going to go and plant these mahogany seeds, see what the other ones are looking like. Yes. Drop off all this other, like the other goop that we have here, so to speak. And I think I can start making some sprinklers for the greenhouse, just prepping those. Because we're going to use quality sprinklers, that's fine. I'm not too concerned about that. I don't know why I went in that chest. That chest has no functionality to us. And two more. Let's do it. And we could make it. So we have the four. I'm wondering if we're going to get those four from the... Actually, we can bank on those four because I think it's four across. Okay, so we can make 21. We don't actually have to make them, but it's good to know that we can make 21. Actually, which is... What's our limiting bar? Which bar is limiting us? Gold. Okay. So we might go and do some gold stuff with our remaining... Oh, this tree grew up. Hello. Oh, and some of our... Yay. That's actually really awesome. Wow, these grew up so fast. I don't think I'm used to mahogany trees growing this fast. They must have changed the growth rates on them. Oh, and it made another seed for us back here. Thanks. That's great. Okay, so we already have three. I'm not going to cut them down yet. I'm going to wait to see if I can shake some seeds out of them first. Oh, wow. The nighttime stuff starts at 7 p.m. at fall. How come I've never noticed that before? It was 8, 8 p.m. Was that summertime or springtime? I like that. Um, gold. Gold is the name of the game. My cat is like snore breathing behind me and it's so, my goodness, it's so cute. I was not expecting a mushroom floor. This is, wow. If only this was, what is it, 1.4? Where like, as soon as you found the mushroom floor, you could just reset that mushroom floor. <laughs> There's a lot of mushrooms, what the heck? Might just sell off all the red ones, honestly. Keep the purple ones, because they're good gifts. Oh yeah, I can go do some mystery boxes and geodes. That's what I can do with some of this money, right? I think I'm going to want to upgrade the coop. That'll be like our next big push. Uh, push? Jeez. Purchase. Um, is upgrading the coop. So just grab this and put one back. Just so I can smelt these when I'm ready. Yeah, just so that we can get... Um, we can get a rabbit in there so that we can start to work towards getting the rabbit foot for the community center because that's one of the last things because now we kind of i think we're in a good position for a truffle which is nice because yeah i think pigs take 10 days they take 10 days normally but i don't know how the blue grass influences this because i heard and i think it's okay talking about this because you're all are watching this and it's been two and a bit months I heard that the blue grass makes animals grow up faster. So that would be really nice with a pig. I don't know how much faster if they do, but I mean, if it's not 10 days, then that's, that's, you know, a whole day's worth of chances for a truffle. So I ain't going to complain. Ow, 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 ow. What? Oh, that was his body. I was like, what was that big black box? It was its body spinning in a circle. How are we doing? 12. Wait, oh shoot, there's a rock crab there. I kind of wanted to get that because rock crabs are... For some reason, that eradication always takes me... Hello? Takes me a bit longer than anticipated. A lot of big rocks, which is good because we need these for the coop. Actually, let me just check this really quick. Kick. Quick. Coop. Because we're going to need a certain amount of rocks for the coop. Stone, we need 200. Okay, so not as bad as the barn. 200, but then we need 500 wood, so we'll have to check our wood supply. 
which might be a good reason to dismantle our not tapper tapper farm scale it down a little bit maybe do five of each I think ten of each was a bit ambitious because I think I had my like modded brain on where I was like oh yeah like resources are easier to get no 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 I really want this yeah because I'm here I want this one too it always makes me laugh when people mention me running by things because the sad thing is is I run by them and I don't even register that I ran by them. So like keep on calling me out if I run by like a mystic stone or whatever because I think it's so funny where I'm like, huh? Oh, whoops. <laughs> My bad. Gold. Ooh, and a shaman. We'll kill that shaman. Because you have not a lot of health, and you're one kill towards... Oh, no. You're one kill towards our eradication, which we want. And I always struggle with this one, too, but I think it's because I just don't spend as much time on these floors as um, was intended. And again, maybe this is through the lens of modded content. I don't know. But we're not rushing the eradication. Okay, I'm going to do one more reset, I think. A strange bun. Is that our first strange bun or did we get one and eat it? I don't know, but we have 28, so we have five bars. That's cool. That's potentially five more sprinklers. I might put on, I had some fire quartz too. Yeah, I'll put on some of those fire quartz. Because I don't know how our refined quartz is working, so we'll just use these. Do I have any more fire quartz in here? No. Oh, but I do have one, two. I don't want to smelt that because, again, for auto stack reasons, and I'll just hang on to the other ones. I don't have to worry about filling this up totally. That's fine. Sorry, I just moved closer to the mic. <laughs> All right, clean up inventory, go to bed, and then traveling merchant day, and we're going to hope for something good. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, I was going to ship all these just because the money will be nice. Put the strange bun in here. Nope, in here. Yep. Oh, and our wine is ready. Hot pepper. Oh, it's red. That's so cool. It's the color of the thing that we put in there. I love that. I love that. So 21, 22. Yes, yeah, so that was actually good that we put on the... Oops, I have some iron with me. I didn't even realize that. I'm going to put that in there. That's fine. How are we doing? A 78 mixed seeds is also really good. Did we get any algae? We did. And we have a magma geode, which is a new addition, apparently. Sweet. And I'm going to pull these up so we remember to take those in. And I think I made this to ship, right? Or actually, before I ship it, let's just use it in the in here. Because I think this might be more points, maybe, than this. No, I don't know. I'm just going to ship it. It's fine. Maybe that was a bad call, but we live with our consequences. We live with our decisions. Did I pet Rue today? I did. Let's go to sleep. Whoa! Thir whoa! We made 4,600. That's awesome. Those mushrooms made us 1,200. That was definitely worth selling. 1,200 is still a lot of money in this state of stage of the game. Okay, it's Friday. What's the weather? It is cloudy with gusts of winds, and it's a good luck. Nice. This is making up for our... Oh, shoot. It was Jody's birthday yesterday. Well... That happened. Um, let's check the mail. Dear Marcus, from what I can tell, you've been taught, you've been taking really good care of your pet. I'm really happy about that. But there are many sweet animals that need a home. If you're interested, I'll start offering pet adoptions at my shop. Sorry, what? I'll start offering pet adoptions at my shop. This is a mod, but this is vanilla. What? Just be aware that there is a licensing fee, and also that each pet will want their own outdoor pet bowl area or else they'll be unhappy robin will be happy to construct additional pet bowls for a price see you soon from marnie that's why robin has pet bowls there and thanks to the ectoplasm you delivered to me i've made a major breakthrough in the field of arcane engineering enclosed you'll find blueprints for a most useful machine from m rasmodius wizard the mini obelisk so that's why robin can craft pet bowls is because you can actually just get more pets sorry i had a hair can we make mini obelisks? We can! Oh, they cost hardwood though, yikes. And gold bars, yikes. Okay, so we might wait. 
wait for those. Um, yeah, we might wait on those a little bit. Those aren't as urgent, I would say. Nothing over here. That's totally fine. Did I just miss putting things into a keg? Oh my gosh, I'm a mess. Okay, we're going to wait until something's up because I'm going to continue to just juggle those around and it's going to irk me. Good morning, 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 good morning. Oh my gosh, Iris went in the water. That was so cute. We got everyone. Nice. Did you give us a duck feather, Iris? No, but we have duck mayo. How much does duck mayo heal compared to... 75, 90. So gold star mayo is much better. Oh, right. We sold a large milk. I was like, what? Oops, oops, oops. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, right. We sold a large goat milk to get the shipping collection. Wherever it is. Right there. Oh, we haven't sold a... Oh, no. We haven't sold a, a small one. Oh, no. They might be too... Okay. I need to remember that. Because I think we might be okay. Yeah, see, like, we just got one from our cows, even though they have, like, max hearts. No, they have three hearts. Okay, I think we're okay. I think we'll still be able to get a small goat's milk to ship. Wow, I can't believe I just forgot about that. Oops, what am I doing? Gosh. that's That was not intended. Oh my gosh, Iris, stop going in the water. It's so cute. Please don't stop. <laughs> We're so close to getting the greenhouse. I think it's either tomorrow or Sunday the pumpkins will be up. So we'll have a greenhouse for next episode, which is awesome. Summer seeds, we have fish talk with halibut. Ooh, garlic. That's a year two crop, so we're gonna get that. Orange sapling, wizard couch, and a rare crow. Okay, nothing really. It's kind of a bummer, but again, we're kind of in an okay spot. We're kind of in an okay spot where we're not like sweating about things anymore. No, you're the wrong dwarf skull color. Is that a golden slime? Are you gonna give us money? It gave us money! It was a golden slime. It was just hiding in there. I was like, that's a... It didn't look gold. It looked more chartreuse, honestly, but... <laughs> that's fine. Maybe it's just because of, like, the background it was surrounded by. Yay, another mahogany seed. I'm gonna kill these slimes. Honestly, there's a lot of them and they they just help with the slime eradication because yeah, the green ones are really weak. Blue ones not as much, but we're here. Seven thousand. Hmm. Maybe I'll wait for the pumpkin harvest to see how much we wanna work on the vault bundle. We're going to have to buy back pumpkin seeds, and then we're going to have to factor in a coop cost into that. How are our skills doing? Level 8 farming. We're doing okay on farming, honestly. Maybe we'll hit level 10, because we have a lot of, we have like, what is it, 216 pumpkins to harvest? We have quite a bit of pumpkins to harvest. It's also, maybe, actually, you know what I might do is I might fish today. Just work on my fishing level a little bit. Maybe we'll go into the mines and get the stonefish and the ghost fish and maybe an ice pip, but my track record with ice pips is not the best. But we have a bunch of deluxe bait that we can use, which is awesome. Yeah, let's do that. I think that'll be fun. That'll be a fun change of pace. We haven't done fishing for um, quite some time. Oh, shoot. Actually, I need to go check on... Um, our forage seeds as well because they might be up they might be up there we go duck mayo locked in oh yeah and I have these garlic seeds which I will grow in the greenhouse so we can get those ready for the island ah and seeds and let's make did I how many I think I need to make like four because I think I planted a few that I did not fertilize. And do you? You already have 30 on you. That's awesome. Yay. Oh, that might be the difference between me being able to catch the ice pip and not. I struggle. Like, we're not even talking the lava eel. We're not even going there. 
Uh, I mean, maybe we'll try, but I mean, the odds of us actually hooking one and it not just being garbage, quite low, honestly. Oh, okay. Are we going to get? We did not. That's kind of a bummer. I would have liked to have used that fertilizer. That's fine. Okay, I think that's a pretty good setup there. So we'll just shake those trees every day for a little bit. Oh, yay. They are up. Okay. So we'll see how many seeds. There's a lot of common mushrooms here. We'll see how many seeds we can make from this. Um, then go and grab the 30 from the chest. And that will dictate how much wheat we chop. Actually, I'm going to do this at the work table because we have some forge in there that can be consumed as well. Oh. Okay, so we have 130. That's I think that's more than enough. I want to put this in here. I know that's not really doesn't make sense. Yeah, I think we can uh probably help with that aside. Because 8 times 4 is 32 times 4 is 128. Yeah, we're fine. Nice. We have like just enough. So I had to think really hard. That's so sad how hard I had to think about that. Yay, and these can all become beers. Because why not? I don't have a mill, so we're just gonna tag them. We'll get a mill eventually. I know it's not the most practical thing, but it looks very nice, and I like having all the all the buildings on my farm. I don't know, it just feels complete that way. Even if it's mostly decorative and less functional. Yay, okay, so I'm happy that this entire plot will be forged now. And yeah, we'll do that second plot that I made down there, um, on like more to the southeast. That one will become another pumpkin plot, this next rotation, I think. And we need to remember to fertilize it all. That's that's the goal, is to remember to fertilize it. There we go. Two, two left. Makes sense. 128. Nine crows? Nine crows in like 12 days. That scarecrow has been there. Feisty. Put away the seeds. Put away the wheat. I'm going to pull this up. Actually, I can put away the blackberries now, too, because I will put them in there. Oh, I put the bread in the wrong chest. And I put I can move the cookies. What am I doing? I can move all these over here. Cookies, bread. There we go. Yeah. Okay, so we'll drop off these ore, and then we will fish. And if we get those three fish, we'll try for the lava eel for a little bit. But again, odds of me catching it are <laughs> quite low. So bring these back with us because that will be nice. But yeah, might as well catch these fish too. And I think I remember because there's that, that, that recipe in Willy's where there's actually a jelly. Oops, I'm in the wrong spot. There's a jelly from in here, right? What is that? The fish rack? I don't remember what it's called. There's like a, there's some sort of machine in Willy's shop. <sighs> I think he needs a jelly. I love the duck. The duck is so cute. Oh, oh, I think you're a stonefish. Because I don't think ghost fish are this feisty. Oh, maybe you are a ghost. No, I think you're a stonefish. It's too irregular to be a ghost fish. Yay! new catch that's awesome so we're just gonna go to 60 because you can catch ghost fish at level 60 as well time to traumatize myself trying to catch an ice pip gosh so bad oh we haven't gone that's new what is this all oh, right <laughs> So much garbage. Nope. Hello? 
Oh, you're just a ghost fish. You're not nice, Pip. Ice Pips have a lot more energy. Please, Iridium Band. Iridium Band. There we go. New catch. First catch. Hello? What are you? Jewels of the sea. Fishing treasure chests have a chance to yield row. Oh, that's so cool. That's cool. I like that. Oh, that'd be really handy because then we could get aged row. Wow. Where is that? That's a cool book. Jewels of the sea. That's a cool book. I like that book. And that made, that's cool that we got it. It's like specific to treasure chest that we got the book in a treasure chest. I love that. Ice Pip? No. Not. not. Ice Pip is, it has the darting behavior. That's why I struggle with it so much. Honestly, this is still just money. Oh, like it's. If we get an Ice Pip, we'll switch that out with the whatever sardine or anchovy, whatever we got for the Stardew Valley Fair. I think that'd be it. You're not an Ice Pip either. You're still just a ghost fish. You're just like a more um, invigorated ghost fish, I would say. Ooh, I think you're a nice pip, though. Please, please. Yeah, I'm not even going to go for this the chest. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Classic. Classic. The Joja Cola, which gives speed now. So awesome. Oh my gosh, all my bait is being used in algae. My duck bobber keeps on getting stuck in all the... <laughs> what the heck? Gosh, not even a ghost fish. There we go, you're a ghost fish. Honestly, I'm okay with ghost fish ghost fish because we still need the fishing EXP. Oh, our energy. Let's grab a few snacks. Four, and we'll do five. Yeah. You're a ghost fish, which means that I can get you. Yes. Will you give us rogue? Because that's so cool, and I want to see that. You did! That's so cool! We got Ghost Fish Row, so we can literally ship one and we can put one into one of our preserves jars to make aged row without even without even going near a fish pond. We'll still get some fish ponds, don't get me wrong, but that's that's so cool. So you could technically just fish some lava eels and just get a bunch of lava eel row by choosing the treasure chest perk. I don't know. Probably not the most cost or time effective, but... Oops. Oops. I want to have at least one other crack at an ice pip. Oops, sorry, ice pip. I think that'd be fun to get at least one more chance. Let's keep on just getting all this gunk, though. Please, 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 please. Mm -hmm. 
Ice pip. Ooh, you're just ghost fish. You're a nice pit. I'm feeling it. Eh. <laughs> I love the duck. I think the duck is, yeah, probably one of my favorites. So, the duck in the boat. We'll go check the bobbers. Not not today, because, I mean, it's 10 p.m., but we'll check them soon enough. Here's just a ghost fish. More ghost fish row? Nope, but we got deluxe bait. That's nice. Because that replenishes some of, yeah, that we've been using. Oh, my energy is running out too. Do two more casts, maybe? Mm, you're just a ghost fish, I think. You're not like annoying enough to be a nice pip, yeah. Yeah, okay, so that might be our last cast. And then I think we might just get go. Oh, it was stolen. It's just a ghost fish, though. So that's okay. Yeah, we'll just go to bed after this. That's fine. I feel accomplished with the day. No reason to putz around anymore. How much total money did we make in ghost fish? 300 and 500. Wow, ghost fish are like really cheap. <laughs> like one. One. Gold star stonefish sells for the same price as like five iridium quality ghost fish. Uh, oh well. Makes sense though. We got the ghost fish really frequently. They're like the carp of the caves. I'm going to sell this stonefish. We can always just catch another one if we need it for any other purpose. I'm going to sell one of those as well. We can do one, two, three. We can actually do three this time, and I cannot be silly about it. There we go. Um, I'll put the row in here. Will I remember it's in there? Probably not. Put that in there. Yeah, that's looking good. And then we ship off this pale ale. Donk. That was a good day. That was a good day too. Money. Whoa. Another 4,300 just from our random little putzing around R&D kind of things. <laughs> I'm sure Willie will sell Ice Pip Row at some point, but. All right, Saturday the 13th. Weather report, weather report is sunny day. And it is skulls. Okay. And yeah, so tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow will be the... Have I sold a honey? Have I actually sold a honey? I'm going to sell this honey because I don't know if I have. I'm just going to sell this honey. You can put away you and you, actually. And let's... Donk, let's go say good morning to sweet little Roo. To sweet little Roo. Hi, Roo. What the heck? What? Where'd that come from? Why did a chub just come flying at me from across? Did it like... Sudoku itself from like... The water? Hello? demon chub oh our fairy rose is ready yay okay so we can plant some stuff here I might I don't know what I want to plant there I might just leave it actually because we'll ship one fairy rose and we'll hang on to the other one for like a birthday gift maybe I don't know I'll put you in here then and I think we'll just ship these cranberry as well because cranberries aren't really worth processing that, what happened with that chub? Like, what the heck? Grab you, because we can bring you down. Uh, 
Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. And let's see if I get a small goat milk today. I'm hoping I will. If spirit is normally you wouldn't want that. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, we're good. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> kinda kinda have an issue going on here. Um <laughs> There we go, okay, and then hang on to that goat's milk. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this fodder in here too. There we go. We got one, two, three. We only still only have three little ones over here. Wait, why is there regular grass? Get out of here before you spread. Yuck. Oh, a new baby duckling hacked. Hacked? Gosh. Um. Okay, we have Iris. So I might. I think I have a name for this one. Iris, and then we will name this one. Oops, if I can do it. Even though they're not similar, but that's fine. Lotus. Iris and Lotus. Boom. Yay, we have a new duckling. Another chance at getting a duck feather soon. Hi, little baby lotus. Uh, we're just going to, yeah, because I'm not going to make too many more coop animals. Because I want to have two uh, rabbits soon. There you go. Look at you. Oh my gosh, I'm waddling out. So cute. Whoa, lots of red mushrooms. Holy. Put five commons in. Oops, nope. Dried morels. Ooh, nice. We got some big money from morels today, too. Is this Stardew Valley fair? It'll be right. It's not. No, okay. I'm losing my mind. I'm thinking I'm going to cut these down. These are, yeah, this is just becoming a an upsetting hazard for me at this point. Saturday, we can go do... Let's go do the hardwood, though. Let's go shake our mahogany trees. So we have... We have 109. That's really good. That's really good. I didn't even see if Robin was working on this. Is our barn done? <gasps> Are you done? It is done. I just walked in there and didn't even notice. Shoot, I just put everything into here. No, because pigs are like 16,000. Oh, no. It's okay. We're going to have the money tomorrow, but what can I salvage? Oh, 12, 13. Mm. I know this isn't like really important, but... Okay, let's try and sell this to Pierre and see how much that gets us. Knowing Marnie, she's like not even going to be in there. <laughs> it's fine. Cute little squirrel. Man, if I had those cheeses, I would have been pretty, I'd be set. We need 16 grand. I could always just try to fish right outside Willie's and then sell them fish too, but Marnie closes so darn early. Sell, 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 sell. Ah, 500 more. <laughs> Not even that pile of sell. so funny. Okay, running back, running back, running back. Do I have any... Will she give money for this? I don't even have a pale ale. I mean, I do, but... Hmm. Hmm. else can I sell? I mean, we could sell some gems. Wait, but he won't buy those. Clint will buy them. There, that's more than enough. Okay, let's panic. And I forgot I had gems. I should just be selling these gems. What the heck? We don't really need to be holding on to them, at least not right now. I don't know. That's a lot of money that we could be working with. Are you in here? You should be, Clint. On Saturday, 11.30? Yeah, you should be here. Sweet. Can I... Thank you. Goodbye. I'll come back maybe in a little bit to... <gasps> Did you have something in your room? No. Sorry. I'm just thinking Adventurer's Guild. Okay. That was very... A lot of back and forth there, which, again... <laughs> time management. Not my forte, but it makes these episodes more real because... It's not like, on day 87, I went and sold money to buy my pig, right? 
Um, sorry, that sounds like I'm just totally jabbing at some people I'm not, I promise. It's just, this is just, I feel like, again, more of a reflection of reality, things that people encounter. Okay, let's hope that Marnie is there. She's probably not. I know she's not there on the 18th because that's her birthday and she always goes to like, the doctor. But it's Abigail's birthday today, so... Please, please, please. <gasps> Oh, hello, this is new. Oh my gosh, invite a new pet into your home. Even if you don't have enough outdoor pet bowls for your pets, they will become upset if you don't have enough. Oh my gosh, it's all the, look at that, we can get another Roo. <gasps> we can get that cute little black one. Oh my gosh, I want this kitty so bad. Oh my gosh, we can get the dogs. Look at this, is like the new one here. I think these are the, what is, hello? What is this? Oh my gosh, this looks like the Ginger Island. You can get turtles? Wait, 500 thou- These are so expensive. These sweeties could use a good home. I agree. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Okay, we're gonna get a pig. We are gonna get a pig. We're gonna get a pig. Mm, I don't know why I'm struggling. <laughs> Fruce? Fruce? Um, what do I want to name you? Let's name you Marigold. Because marigolds are very important for gardens, but they stink, right? Like, so they're usually not fondly looked upon. And I think that's the kind of same with pigs, where pigs are not the most com fondly looked upon animal, but they are so crucial. So crucial. We got a pig. Okay, so we got a pig on the 13th, so the 26th. No, 23rd. Oh, we're doing great. We're cruising. We should. Okay, so we should get the truffle. So I don't need to buy a truffle if I see a truffle. These, they always look like they hurt their paws. Is that just me? These goats? Like, it, it, hello, Marigold. Hi, you. I think it's a male. I think pigs are, class, are considered males. Probably said to his home. Marigold, the, the man. I don't know. It's fine. Why do we need gender names? Um... Let's get some stuff. Let's get some stuff. I totally got derailed now. I, I need to go check the mahogany trees too. I'll do that right after this. Doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just came from around the corner. That was scary. Okay, this is great, yeah, because then once we get that pumpkin harvest too, we will get the um, the greenhouse, and then we can hoe for the new pumpkin patch and the greenhouse, and then send in the hoe. Get that two gold quality sooner than later. Alongside the a coop upgrade, which again, I don't know how much I'm gonna make from the pumpkins, but I know pumpkins are quite profitable. But we did not fertilize them, so I don't know how profitable they're going to be. How long are you hiding? There we go. Probably some more down here. Nice. 12 more. Slow and steady. Do you remember in 1.4 when that was the only way to get hardwood? <laughs> I do. I remember going there every day for months on my Switch. <sighs> that was the end game. Hardwood. <laughs> Alright, let's go see what's happening with our trees. Um. Maybe I'll spend some time just tilling that land down there just to prep it a little bit so we don't have to spend as much time watering it. Because even though half of it will like decay. Also, I want to see if we can tap this weird moss tree. Um, okay. Seed? 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 Wow, really? Alright, be that way. Um, yeah, let's go make a tapper. Let's spend today cleaning up our farm a little bit because I want to clean up that tree farm down there um, just south of this crop field a bit too. I think we're just not tapping it so I don't want to... I don't want it there. <laughs> Essentially, that's what it is. 
Let's make a tapper though. Wait, do I have a tapper made before I do this? No, okay. So make a tapper and we have our hoe. We're good. Okay. So let's go in and see what's up with this tree. Hello? Hello? Uh, oh, okay. Apparently you can't tap them. Weird. I would have sworn you... Okay, apparently you can't tap them. I would have sworn nothing. <laughs> Just can't tap them. Um, okay. Well, I'm going to put it in here because I'm going to cut down these trees. So there's no point in tapping them, like putting taps on those if I'm just going to be cutting them down. Let's go and ho- oh shoot, I need my- actually I have my sword, it's fine. Yeah, let's go and hoe this ground a little bit. That's probably going to, yeah. Peel this back a little bit. Oh my gosh, this grass spreads so fast. So good. It'd be so sad to see it all go. Oh, and I can do this, right? I forgot that I had a bronze hoe. Is it copper? Copper hoe. Oh, 7 p.m. <laughs> Nighttime. Yeah, I know this is kind of like wasted energy a little bit, but if it just means I don't have to water as much tomorrow, then I'm here for it. Um, okay, so we're going to have to do some math. We're going to have to do some math. Shoot, did I get it? No, I didn't. Okay, because this is another plus 32, right? Eight, no, 32 times 2 times 3. 8 times 4 is 32, times 3 is 96, so plus 96. We have, and I wrote 216, but I think it was 206. 206 plus 90, what did I say? 90, 32 times 96 is, I can't do math, 290, oh my gosh, what is that, 402? No, it isn't. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Let's just use a phone for this. 302. Oh my gosh, it's added in an extra 100 out of nowhere. Okay, 302, but then we have a few other crop spots um, in our, like that main one right in front of the house. Goodness. Ah, oh, brain. I know some of you can relate, some of you cannot relate because, you know, math is just like mental math, especially you've kind of kept up with it and it's it's right there in the forefront of your head. Hey, so. OK, so we have 302 plus. Um, seven. So 309, 309. OK. 309, let me write that down because I'm going to forget that in the next three minutes. 309, okay, let's spend the rest of the time starting to cut down these. Sad day, but they're just, they're not serving a purpose except for being an obstacle, right? They're a fun obstacle course, but beyond that, and it's wood at the end of the day, it's resources, so they're, they're still a benefit. Oops. Um, that might be okay, actually, because I think we're going to peel up this path ring, too. Yeah, and we'll just be a little bit more strategic where we plant these, and I don't even know, we might just plant some... No, we can still plant, like, five, but I think we'll start with just the oak ones to get the oak resin for kegs. So we'll do, like, five oak trees somewhere. I'm thinking there's like on the left side of the farm, there's like a little island of like this grass stuff where there won't be 
any bluegrass or crops being able to grow in there, so I might just put them there, honestly. I love the moss on the trees. Oops. Yeah, especially like the oak trees with like the little mushrooms growing out of it. Very like lichen looking. It's cool. Oh, we might actually be able to get most of these. I know it's going to be energy that stops us before time. Do we use this or do we hold it to trade? I think we use it because our forging still isn't leveled up. Let's use it. Right? Because I think it says that it gives us forging XP. We didn't level up. Oh, we're gonna be pretty close. I might have to eat like one or two salmon berries to finish off, which is fine. Yeah, like look at how much space this was taking. And not that we need the space, like we're not like running out of room for things, but still. Be a little bit more intentional with it, maybe. Let's eat one, see how far that gets us. Oh, that might be good. This looks like the tree that we planted, but the other tree grew from a moss seed, no? Here we go. Oh, and I don't know what to do with this. We'll take it with us. Because there's it, it does better around wild trees is what it said. Um, bonk and oh, we got a moss seed. I didn't know you could get a moss or a mossy seed. So was that tree a mossy tree then? Did it just like become one? I'm confused. All right, well let's grab some things. I know we just uh, let's do summer squash in here. Let's see how much this is because these are worth. 49 each so I'm assuming it'll be more because when we kegged one it was like a hundred something um, Let's put you no 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 The path that's what I wanted to do and Drop those in there and I'm thinking I'll just come in. I think I have enough time I'm just gonna put it in this pile of trees over here, which I know are not the most densely I don't know how the range on this thing, but I'm gonna put it right there looks great. I don't think any NPCs go there, so I don't think it should get destroyed. Maybe, maybe Abigail goes there. I don't know. Oh, well, let's go to bed. Start the last day of this episode. How are we doing on time? 153. Okay, looking pretty good. Maybe it's going to be a little bit of a shorter episode, but not by much at all. 2,500. Oh, yeah, the mystery chub. The demon chub. I forgot about that. Okay, how are we looking on for the next episode? Rain! Nice. And it is a very... Oh, wait. You know what I noticed is some of them, like... So this must be, like, not the best luck day. Because some of them had, like, red, like, sparklies around it. So that must be, like, a very good luck day or something. And we learned trout soup. I don't know. That'd be something that'd be interesting to correlate with. Yay, pumpkins! Um, UI info suite to see what's going on there. Kaylee, animal stuff first. Good morning, Rue. You checking out the pumpkins? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I should, uh, it's fine. Wow, look at how different this looks. Oh my gosh, it looks so naked. Oh, there's trees here, that's kind of annoying. All right, good morning, good morning, good morning, yay. I'm missing one of my coop. Oh, because they're literally in here, okay. Thank you, thank you. No duck egg today. No, nope, because we had three going, so that makes sense. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Oh, yeah, we have a piggy. We have marigold. Right. Um, marigold sounds like more like a cow name, but that's fine. Is it? A, I don't think it's a goat day. I think we had a goat day. Yeah, yesterday. Okay. Okay, so now we are slowly working towards a coop upgrade. Unless there's a rabbit foot in the traveling merchant today. I'm gonna hold on to these because we're gonna go to Pierre's. Actually, let's go check the traveling merchant today because I think 3300 is enough to buy most things from her that we would want to get. 
And then we can sell this all to Pierre. Ooh. We'll ship one pumpkin though, so it registers into our shipping collection. Do, 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 do. See what's going on here. What's crack a lacking? Pumpkin seeds, no super crumb, no cactus fruit. We'll get to the desert eventually. Five quality sprinklers for 1800. I mean, we don't have the money. And one straw floor for 600. Hello. So no rabbit's foot. It's a bummer. All right. Let's finish off a room in the community center here. Oh, you know what I should do? Just in preparation while I'm down here. Oh, okay. There's like a really decent amount of it that stayed. That's actually really nice. Yeah, that's really nice. Seven, eight... Nine, ten, only 11, 12 spots that we have to water. That's not bad at all. Unless I just started counting late, which is only also highly probable. Because I'm a little bit of a scatterbrain sometimes. If you haven't. <laughs> oh, that's a level 9 farming. Yay. Can we get level 10 today? Can we get level 10? Because then we'll get the artisan perk. Also, did I pet all my animals? I did. If we get level 10, then I will not sell those pale ales. I will wait until we have the perk. Oh, I was, gonna, I was talking about moving these, but I think I'm going to wait to move them. Actually, no, we'll see if I have time. We'll see. I feel like we can get level 10. I think we have a lot of, a lot of pumpkins that will get us there. Sure, I need me scythe for. I need me scythe for those little things of wheat. That's not the chest I wanted. There we go. Can I scythe these? No. <laughs> Worth a try. Don't know what's added. Did I already try that at one point? Maybe. Honestly, pop that this as well on. Honestly, because we've we've gotten yeah. I know that might be a crime. Some of you might have been offended by that, but I think that being a pumpkin, I don't know. It'll just look nicer. I think that's the main reason I didn't want just like the one cranberry tree there. Might have or bush. It might have generated more profit honestly than a pumpkin, but. Eh. So are these going to be ready on the last day of fall? Is that what's going to happen here? Cool. Well, 10, 40. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to ship one. We didn't get level 10 farming. I just realized that. Or did we? Oh, we did. Okay, so yeah, won't sell those, won't sell those pale ales. And we might actually hang on to some pumpkins because they turn around in like three days. So we'll hang on to some of the regular quality. I just want to see... Oh. I should grab the yam. Jeez, wasting time again. What's new? I think this music is really quieted down. There, how's that? I turned up the music like a decent amount there. Let me know if that's too much and you preferred it how it was. Where am I going? I'm being distracted. Yeah, let me know if you prefer it the way it was as opposed to now. But. I'm just looking at OBS and I was like, wait, the music is like really soft. Or like the game sound, I should say. So it should be more noticeable now. I don't know where to the flash cards. I think they're on like the south table. They are, they're right beside the diamonds. That's where they go. Use fertilizer. Okay. Have we not found that many lost books? I haven't been hoeing the ground a whole lot. Shame on me. Um, let's just walk there. It's fine. Sorry, Pam. Hey. 
you go. Bustling and bustling. Look at you rock and roll. Holy, oh my gosh, this one got collided into. That was scary. Um, oh, it looks, I love this little like leafy like, mushroomy patch with just like decaying leaves. We're finishing a room. I'm so excited. And I actually will dance with the Juno this time. Okay, we got one pumpkin. Ooh, not half the pumpkins, just one. Just one. And we have a yam. Bundle complete. What do we get from the fall crops? Oh, a bee house. Okay. Yay. Oh my gosh. We have the... <gasps> We're going to have the greenhouse at the beginning of next episode. It's so exciting. This house is empty. The trees moved in. Sorry, this house was empty for years. The trees moved in and so did we. Yeah, hey, 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 hey. So does that update on here? Where is that thing? Where does that have that? Oh, here, it did. Nice. I don't know what room it was. Vault. Oh, it only tells you the ones that aren't done. Okay. Yeah, hey, hey. Look at buddy. We can actually dance with you. So cute. Oh my gosh, a little hop and skip. Stop, you're breaking my heart. Um, okay, so my question is, can we sell this stuff? Can we rebuy the pumpkins and will we have enough for a coop to get Robin started on that? Help wanted crabs. Oh, okay, we might be able to do that one, honestly. Hi, Pierre, I have some things for you. I'm gonna sell you all of these first. I can sell you the wheat too, sure. I'll sell you the quality one. Whoa! Okay, that's a lot more money than I thought it would be. Now let's keep 20, maybe? Or 15, I guess. Oh, oh okay, we're, keep, we're still going. Alright, 86,000 though. How many did I need again? 309. So that's... We still have 55,000? Alright, let's let's go ask for a coop upgrade before we do anything, because I'm scared Robin is going to close on us. Uh, which chrome did I have for coop? There we go, this one. Um, 500 wood and 200 stone. Oh, yeah, actually, I don't... Hmm. Do we have... Do we have the stone, I think, is my biggest concern to do this. Okay, I'm gonna put the pumpkins in here to put into there. We can put this down. Bonk. And I know we could have put a fairy rose next to it, but that's fine. Oh, it's okay. We're just gonna buy the stone. I that's like goes against everything that I that's in me, but I want that upgrade so bad. materials when you can just get them. If it was a Jojo run, I feel like it'd be very different, right? Because then the mentality of it's different, but... Worms! Oh! Oh, there's more. Ah, my gosh, I need to go to Robins. I got those worms on the way out. Priorities. Hey, Robin, can I shop from you, and can I buy... I don't know, I need to do this in so that I can never get my money! Oh my gosh, I'm spending all the things that I can just get. I'm gonna buy one. So that I have one for the... Construct farming leaves. Can you make me a large, a deluxe, more so, coop? And then we'll... I think we'll paint them after the deluxe coop is done. Yay! That feels so good! I was not expecting to have that done so early on. Um, actually, while we have the money, let's buy these things that I said we were gonna buy. Rustic brick stone, snapping straw, crystal. The rest of this we can wait. Uh, no, let's just buy those, it's fine. The, the braziers, we'll wait for a little. Let's, we don't need to stress. A seasonal plant. 
I don't know why I always buy things in twos. And a brown fish. I'm wasting money. Mmm, worms. Oh! It's an artifact. We like those. That feels really good getting that coop upgrade, okay, because then we can just get that chick. No, jeez. The rabbit. We got the rabbit, and we have enough money for a rabbit right now, too. And I think with, like, our daily animal income, we'll be fine. I need to make a bunch of fertilizer. Do I have any fertilizer? At 31, okay. So I need to make... That should be good. Okay, let's start with the, the quality fertilizer because this will be really great. Man, I wish I spread this down before because we would have gotten so much more money if I was just a bit more thinking. I'm so excited to get the greenhouse. Oh no, but we can't move it for a few days because we just need to the building. That's okay. We'll move it once she's on the coop. It's not the end of the world. I move this here. Yes, is the answer. So that I can water all these little spots as I'm coming to them. This is a good way to finish the episode. I'm very happy with this. Probably take down these lightning rods too, hey? Let's just come from here while we're over here. Yeah, I feel like I can take down these lightning rods. Hello? There we go. 181. Yeah, I think we'll just sit on this and this will be like a wintertime project, honestly. I'm figuring out where to put these. And I mean, all the grass will die anyway, so we'll have a nice kind of like clean slate to figure it out, map it out. Oops, 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 oops. Dun, 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 dun. Did I miss any? Maybe, but if I did, I did. Honestly, it's not the end of the world. Yes. Oh no, Lou, you're, you're preventing me from planting things, my friend. There we go. Thanks, Rue. Read my mind. Okay, and then we'll go do this spot down here. 92, that seems well right. Where is it? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's take up the bulk of the day. It always happens with the big plant. Scarecrow's in place, which is nice. And there we go. I missed out on a sum. Honestly, I'm over it. It's fine. It's like four of them will just be not have the, the you know, an increased chance of being a higher quality. Oh well. There we go. I'm doing like the weirdest way to plant all this right now. I don't know. Do we have 92? How does that make sense? Well, I think we have some extras over here regardless, so I think that's okay. Yeah, I think we have some extras. 
right? We bought like 10 extra or something, so... In here, I'm gonna bring two, because I don't actually remember. Did I do the mahogany trees today? I don't think so. Let's go and take a little peek up there after this. Oh, it was just one. Okay. Right? I think everything else is good. Yes. That feels good, having another patch. Gosh, all my crops are so spread out on this farm, which is kind of fun, honestly. It's kind of fun. And it's just for right now, for year one. I think after this, we'll get a little bit more um, intentional how we do things. Really? None of you want to give them mahogany seeds? Really? That's so sad. Okay. Um, I'm going to put this arrowhead into the go-to-town chest. Should have filled my... Oh, I'm going to grab three. Yep. We're going to grab one, two, three of these. Let's put these in. Start getting these coming up. Coal can go in here. That's fine. Stone. Seed. Don't ship the pale ale yet. I'm going to put these, let's put these on either side of here. Oh, lovely. Okay. Put you there. I got the couch for in our tiny little house. I don't know where we're going to put this massive couch. Right there. It looks great. Oh, but now I can't get to the... Actually, can I? I can't. Um, tricky. Hmm. Can I not grab this plant? I don't want to... I want to grab the plant. Is it because this is an outdoor plant? Weird. Why does this have a different interaction than this one? Uh, I'm going to... That's going to bug me. I'm going to put the plant right there. Okay. There. Now we can slack this. this. Yes. Looks great. Looks great. Um, the only thing I want to do is fill my watering can and put it away, I think, in the scythe. And then we're just going to call this an episode. How are we doing on time? How are we doing on my voice still being heard? We're doing great. We're doing really great. 212. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty standard, I'd say. Hey. Awesome. Um, again, reminder... Just a reminder that I know there might be some things you want to share about spoilers, but I appreciate how respectful all of you have been. You've been so great. So I may have said some things today that may allude to me wanting to know, but I promise I don't want to know um, unless it's something that I've talked about where I'm like, well, we all know this already. Let's talk about it. Okay. But that is going to bring this episode to a close. That's halfway through fall already. Hey, oh, yay! I forgot about this. We got the Hello. Okay, that's a fun new little addition there. Poor little guy, excavated from his house. Um, <laughs> Juno was probably like, what the heck? Yay, oh, we got the seed maker as well. That's awesome. Okay, we're going to make that seed maker as soon as possible. And we are going to go artisan because we're actually, with all of our animal products, like we're actually, this will be quite beneficial um, rather than having things grow 10% faster, I think. So we're going to go artisan. Does one pumpkin self Jeez, one gold star pumpkin sells for so much. My goodness, that's all I gotta say. Alright, well, that's episode 10. Done. In the bag. We're coming back to a rainy day. We are coming back to a bad luck day. Awesome. Oh, I have a couch to sit on. Yay. Um, okay, I will see you all in the next episode. Thanks for popping by. I'm looking forward to all of your comments because they've been so fantastic lately. Um, they've been so fantastic lately and you can always like reply to each other too because you, you all have really great ideas But yeah, I will see you in episode 11 until then. Bye. Bye for now